Hello YouTube, Tom back here again for Internet Gaming. This um do you like the new intro by the way? Me and Omar have been make made it last night, just a quick little one. We didn't really do much to be honest. Um, just put a picture in the background and then just put stuff over it. But it will do for the moment. Anyway, I got some Gears of War 3 today and <laughs> I moved on from my Modern Warfare 3 and now I'm on to Gears. It, um, I'm playing TDM in Old Town. In this, in Gears of War 3, it's different to Modern Warfare 3. Modern Warfare 3, you have in Team Deathmatch, you have to kill a certain amount of people. In Gears of War 3, there's a certain amount of respawns, so it changes it because. You, you also have to think about survivability and if you're making a contribution to your team so really it's all about your KD and stuff anyway I'm do I do well in this game and I I am I miss a couple of shots there but yeah <laughs> uh, old town it's it was in the beta if anyone played the beta it's um, got a few power weapons in it. You pick up weapons in this game, unlike Call of Duty, where you just spawn with them. Uh, there's um, normally their weapons are based around the middle of the map, so you have to push into the middle, which I like. And on this map, there is frag grenades in the middle here. To my left, there is a sniper, and to my right, there is a digger launcher. The digger launcher, it base yeah, basically the digger. It goes on the ground and then when it seems to find something and it explodes. Normally getting a couple of kills if you're skilled with them. Uh, I wanna to talk to you about a new series that I'm gonna be starting, hopefully, if you guys want me to or not. Uh, I have a game, Midnight Club. I'm I'm gonna start I want wanna start a let's play because not many people do it on YouTube and I do think it's a really fun game uh, let me know but if you want me to then I'll, I'll post it every Thursday for um, till I finish it I'll restart the campaign and um, complete it You'll, you will enjoy it uh, the future of our channel um, our channel is uploading a lot more like a lot uploading daily at least. Um Dylan still doesn't have a mic. <laughs> he's gonna get he's gonna order one today I think and should be soon. And Samed is uploading I think today. But I'm not sure it might be tomorrow when you lost here. Uh Gears of War 3. Um what other games you want me to do guys? I got I might just one two like tutorial sort of thing. Cause I know like lots of people I haven't seen any commentaries on it or anything. A lot of people actually have the game. Uh here, here you see I got the digger launcher and I'm just picking up and today. I got there's a couple of bots in this game. Uh, I don't know why. They just just like just there. My lovely shotgun aiming, which is actually very terrible. People just don't under, they're not clever. They, it, they don't use their cover to their advantage. Like, I'm 15 and 2 now, but really because I've won the shotgun things, it's because I have utilized the cover around me. Um, like, um, when you shotgun you should wall bounce. It's called wall bouncing, but what you do is you basically tap A towards a wall so it um, pushes you into that direction. Normally uh getting away from the um, uh, shotgun bullet. Here you see on every round different weapons. So instead of a sniper and a digger this time, this side they have got a torque bullet which is basically a bow with explosive arrows. It's pretty cool. Um, wait for it to load, though, which is annoying. But it's really accurate. He, <laughs> someone misses completely. Oh, I love this game. It's quite funny. 
I don't know, I, if he shot me just there, I would have died. I would have been dead. As you, oh yeah, on the other side of the map, they got a boom shot, which the other team just picked up. That's a really, it's like a big rocket launcher, and it's really powerful. Oh no, I, I died from that guy. Anyway, <laughs> I haven't played, I, I recorded this game today like, five days ago, something like that. Uh, so yeah, I will start um, a midnight club thing, probably, th on Thursday I'll probably start playing. Um, I can record commentary over it afterwards, or I can do a live commentary, which would be easier. I might start doing it more. Um, I've got another step with my PC, I bought a graphics card, it came today. Uh, I, I might be just buying a whole computer off Samendo. So soon hopefully I'll have a computer to play stuff on. I might be buying another uh, game called Torchlight 2 coming out. Not not many people know about it. Hopefully I wanna buy it. Dylan's gonna be playing it anyway. But um I might buy it and then play with him. <laughs> I die. As you see the torque bow when it shoots you it just it gets there and then it just explodes and it kills anyone instantly. But now, oh, I edited this bit out, guys, because I have my my phone started ringing from Dylan surprisingly, asking about YouTube. And no, it was about football presentation. It always happens to me though. Like everything I do, it's always interrupted by some sort of thing like that. Uh, we lose this round. <laughs> There's locust and horde. Um, I'm on horde. Which is basically, oh no, there's locust and cog. Sorry, um, locust are these big alien monsters, and uh, cog are the like the humans' futuristic soldier, which I think quite cool. Um, because it's one all now, so weapons spawn back to the original sniper and then guy. See what I just did there, I bounced off the cover, I went into it and then came back off straight away. It's really a good tactic against other things. Other people using shotguns. Uh I I you can get weapon skins on it which is quite cool compared to Gizra 2 and 3. I'm running the tiger skin for my Lancer, which I think looks really cool with all the different patterns on. And I got the flame skin for my Nasher or shotgun. Um, it's like you have to get it in the beta, you had to be in the beta to do it. But <laughs> I just got wrecked by some bot. Like, bots are really easy to kill, but sometimes you just get lucky kills because obviously they have aimbot. Um, and I should I should actually lose this game because I have like four bots on my team. No, I have three because the guy just joined like now, and they have loads of players. They have this player here, which obviously didn't pay attention to the spawns, and they have um another two other players. This game isn't that popular anymore. Like I, when I go into a lobby, there's normally a couple of bots in it. At least. I don't know why, maybe people just got sick of it after a while, like most games. <laughs> Get a nice headshot on that guy. I I mean, I have go on and off in games, and at the moment I like this game, but probably soon I won't be playing it anymore. So, yeah. <laughs> people are so bad. No bots are so bad. Like, the same guy just randomly headshot me earlier, and I saw him on the wall holding his smoke grenade. It's just, they need to fix the boss in this game, make them more, uh, like, realistic. Like, they just move around the map randomly. And, like, normally, if your spawns go away, everyone camps and set in, like, in their spawn or something. But, um, the bots just run up at you, and they just die, like, instantly. Which is really unhelpful. Um... The other two rounds I use the shotgun a lot now, but this round I'm using the Lancer, like, it just depends what you want to do, because I, you can get from cover to cover and get close to them with a shotgun, or if you feel confident enough, you can just spray them down with a Lancer. As you can see, there's only three more players than the other team, 
So yeah, this guy runs away like a pussy. <laughs> he doesn't want to die. Uh, yeah, see, look, this is their spawn, and so they'll just try and camp here. But look, the bot is just out in the open, like nowhere. So I'll take him down right here. And spotting on this game is really helpful if you play Battlefield. You know, spotting. So if you click in the left toggle then they'll come up on everyone's map no one really does it on this game though but it's very helpful to other people giving them a heads up of where they are bots do it all the time which I like but other people don't I think the last guy is camping by the sniper if I'm correct I think he kills me but I come back and kill him yeah I think he kills me here he's up there and then I run around and he's not there and then he comes around the corner and kills me or someone. Something stupid. Probably because I'm not paying attention. Uh, yeah, I think I hear bullets over here. So I run over here. And I see him down there. And I'm just waiting. Because I don't want to, like, disturb him. <laughs> I don't want to. I want to take him by surprise. But it, it ends up failing. And um, he notices me. So I get down here and he notices me there. Yeah, he actually hit his shotgun bullets this time. But no worries. My team will kill them or I will kill them. Probably me. Because the bots are retarded, as you can see. I've got another person on my team now. I've got that Stitchy T. But he's pretty shit also. Luckily enough, he spawned right by my spawn, so I just shotgun, shotgun him right here. Got someone more like stab him. <laughs> Got MVP. Locust won the match. Hope you enjoyed the commentary. See you again.